The Asiatic lion is a Panthera leo leo population in India. Its range is restricted to the Gur Forest National Park and environs in the Indian state of Gujarat. On the IUCN Red List it is listed under its former scientific name Panthera leo persica as endangered because of its small size and area of occupancy. The Asiatic lion was first described in 1826 by the Austrian zoologist Johann N. Meyer who named it Felis leo persicus. Until the 19th century, it occurred in eastern Turkey, Iran, Mesopotamia, and from east of the Indus River to Bengal and Narmada River in central India. Since the turn of the 20th century, it is restricted to the Gur Forest National Park and surrounding areas. This lion population has steadily increased since 2010. In May 2015, the 14th Asiatic Lion Census was conducted over an area of about 20,000 square kilometers, 7,700 square miles. The lion population was estimated at 523 individuals, comprising 109 adult males, 201 adult females, and 213 cubs. In August 2017, a similar census revealed 650 wild individuals. The lion is one of five pantheran cats inhabiting India, along with the Bengal tiger, Indian leopard, snow leopard, and clouded leopard. It was also known as Indian lion and Persian lion. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Taxonomic history. Following Meyer's first description of an Asiatic lion skin from Persia, other naturalists and zoologists also described lions from other parts of Asia that used to be considered synonyms of P.L. Persica In 1829, Edward Turner Bennett published a book about the animals kept in the Tower Menagerie. His essay about lions contains a drawing titled, Bengal Lion Felis Leo Bengalensis. In 1833, Walter Smee exhibited two skins of lions from Gujarat in a meeting of the Zoological Society of London. He presented these skins of maneless lions under the name Felis Leo Gujaratensis. In 1834, Sir William Jardine, seventh baronet proposed the name Leo Asiaticus for the Asiatic lion. In 1843, Henri-Marie Ducroté de Blainville published a drawing of an Asiatic lion skull under the name Felis Leo Indicus. In 2017, the Asiatic lion was subsumed to P.L. Leo due to close morphological and genetic similarities with North African lion specimens. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Evolution. Fossil remains of Panthera spelia excavated in the Cromer stage indicate that it represented a genetically isolated and highly distinct lineage. Fossil lion remains were found in Pleistocene deposits in West Bengal. A fossil carnassial found in the Batadomba cave indicates that Panthera leo sinhalius inhabited Sri Lanka during the late Pleistocene, and is thought to have become extinct around 39,000 years ago. This lion was distinct from today's lion and was described by Dariniagala in 1939. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Lion phylogeography. Results of a phylogeographic analysis based on mtDNA sequences of lions from across the global range indicates that sub-Saharan African lions are phylogenetically basal to all modern lions. These findings support an African origin of modern lion evolution with a probable center in East and Southern Africa. It is likely that lions migrated from there to West Africa, Eastern North Africa and via the periphery of the Arabian Peninsula into Turkey, Southern Europe and Northern India during the last 20,000 years. The Sahara, tropical rainforest and the Great Rift Valley are natural barriers to lion dispersal. Genetic markers of 357 samples from captive and wild lions from Africa and India were examined during a study on lion evolution. Results suggest four lineages of lion populations, one in Central and North Africa to Asia, one in Kenya, one in Southern Africa, and in from Southern and East Africa. The first wave of lion expansion is thought to have occurred about 118,000 years ago from East Africa into West Asia, and the second wave in the late Pleistocene or early Holocene periods from Southern Africa towards East Africa. The Asiatic lion is genetically closer to North and West African lions than to the group comprising East and Southern African lions. The two groups probably diverged about 186,000 to 128,000 years ago. 
It is thought that the Asiatic lion remained connected to North and Central African lions until gene flow was interrupted due to extinction of lions in Europe and the Middle East. Asiatic lions are genetically less diverse than lions in Africa, which may result from a founder effect in the recent history of the remnant population in the Gur forest. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Characteristics The Asiatic lion's fur ranges in color from ruddy tawny, heavily speckled with black, to sandy or buffish gray, sometimes with a silvery sheen in certain lights. Males have only moderate mane growth at the top of the head, so that their ears are always visible. The mane is scanty on the cheeks and throat where it is only 10 cm long. About half of Asiatic lion's skulls from the Gur forest have divided infraorbital foramina, whereas African lions have only one foramen on either side. The sagittal crest is more strongly developed, and the post-orbital area is shorter than in African lion. Skull length in adult males ranges from 330 to 340 mm 13 to 13 in, and in females from 292 to 302 mm 11.5 to 11.9 in. It differs from the African lion by a larger tail tuft and less inflated auditory bully. The most striking morphological character of the Asiatic lion is a longitudinal fold of skin running along its belly. Shoulder height of males is 107 to 120 centimeters, 3.51 to 3.94 feet, and of females 80 to 107 centimeters, 2.62 to 3.51 feet. Head and body measurements of two lions in Gur forest were 1.98 meters, 78 in each, with tail lengths of 0.79 to 0.89 meters, 31 to 35 in, and total lengths of 2.82 to 2.87 meters, 111 to 113 in, respectively. The Gur lion is similar in size to the Central African lion and smaller than large African lions. Adult males weigh 160 to 190 kilograms, 350 to 420 pounds, while females weigh 110 to 120 kilograms, 240 to 260 pounds. Topic: Manes. Color and development of manes in male lions varies between regions, among populations and with age of lions. In general, the Asiatic lion differs from the African lion by a less developed mane. The manes of most lions in ancient Greece and Asia Minor were also less developed and did not extend to below the belly, sides or ulnas. Lions with such smaller manes were also known in the Syrian region, Arabian Peninsula and Egypt, whereas Barbary and Cape lions had underbelly hair. In contrast, a relief from Nineveh in the Mesopotamian plain shows a lion with underbelly hair. Therefore, it was suspected that the Mesopotamian lion may have been a distinct subspecies, for which the scientific name Panthera leo mesopotamica was proposed. Exceptionally sized lions The record total length of a male Indian lion is 2.92 meters, 115 in, including the tail. Emperor Jahangir allegedly speared a lion in the 1620s that measured 3.10 meters, 122 in, and weighed 306 kilograms, 675 pounds. In 1841, Austin Henry Layard accompanied hunters in Khuzestan, Iran, and sighted a lion which had done much damage in the plain of Ram Hormuz before one of his companions killed it. He described it as being unusually large and a very dark brown color, with some parts of its body being almost black. In 1935, a British admiral claimed to have sighted a maneless lion feeding on a goat near Kedah. He wrote, It was a large lion, very stocky, light tawny in color, and I may say that no one of us three had the slightest doubt of what we had seen until, on our arrival at Kedah, many officers expressed doubts as to its identity, or to the possibility of there being a lion in the district. Distribution and habitat In the Gur Forest, an area of 1,412.1 square kilometers (545.2 square miles) was declared as a sanctuary for Asiatic lion conservation in 1965. This sanctuary and the surrounding areas in Saurashtra, western India, are the only wild habitats supporting the Asiatic lion. 
After 1965, a national park with an area of 258.71 square kilometers (99.89 square miles) was established where human activity is not allowed. In the surrounding sanctuary only Maldharis have the right to take their livestock for grazing. Lions inhabit remnant forest habitats in the two hill systems of Gur and Gurner that comprise Gujarat's largest tracts of dry deciduous forest, thorny forest and savanna, and provide valuable habitat for a diverse flora and fauna. Five protected areas currently exist to protect the Asiatic lion, Gur Sanctuary, Gur National Park, Pania Sanctuary, Midiala Sanctuary, and Gurner Sanctuary. The first three protected areas form the Gur Conservation Area, a 1,452 square kilometres forest block that represents the core habitat of the Asiatic lions. The other two sanctuaries, Midiala and Gurner, protect satellite areas within dispersal distance of the Gur Conservation Area. An additional sanctuary is being established in the nearby Barta Wildlife Sanctuary to serve as an alternative home for Gur lions. The drier eastern part is vegetated with acacia thorn savanna and receives about 650 mm in annual rainfall. Rainfall in the west is higher at about 1000 mm in per year. The lion population recovered from the brink of extinction to 411 individuals by 2010. In that year, approximately 105 lions lived outside the Gur forest, representing a quarter of the entire lion population. Dispersing sub-adults established new territories outside their natal prides, and as a result the satellite lion population has been increasing since 1995. By 2015, the total population had grown to an estimated 523 individuals, inhabiting an area of 7,000 square kilometers 2,700 square miles in the Saurashtra region. The Asiatic Lion Census conducted in 2017 revealed about 650 individuals. Topic. Former range The Asiatic lion used to occur in Arabia, Palestine, Mesopotamia and Baluchistan. In South Caucasia, it was known since the Holocene and became extinct in the 10th century. Until the middle of the 19th century, it survived in regions adjoining Mesopotamia and Syria, and was still sighted in the upper reaches of the Euphrates River in the early 1870s. By the late 19th century, the Asiatic lion had become extinct in Turkey. The last known lion in Iraq was killed on the Lower Tigris in 1918. Historical records in Iran indicate that it ranged from the Khuzestan Plain to the Fars province at elevations below 2,000 meters (6,600 feet) in steppe vegetation and pistachio almond woodlands. It was widespread in the country, but in the 1870s, it was sighted only on the western slopes of the Zagros Mountains, and in the forest regions south of Shiraz. It served as the national emblem and appeared on the country's flag. Some of the country's last lions were sighted in 1941 between Shiraz and Jaram in the Fars province, and in 1942, a lion was spotted about 65 kilometers 40 miles northwest of Desfil. In 1944, the corpse of a lioness was found on the banks of the Karun River in Iran's Khuzestan province. Reginald Innes Pocock suggested that the restricted distribution of the Asiatic lion in India indicates that it was a comparatively recent immigrant and arrived in the country through Persia and Baluchistan, before humans limited its dispersal. In the early 19th century, the Asiatic lion occurred in Sindh, Bahawalpur, Punjab, Gujarat, Rajasthan, Haryana, Bihar and eastward as far as Palamau and Rua, Madhya Pradesh. It once ranged to Bengal in the east and up to the Narmada River in the south, but declined under heavy hunting pressure. The advent and increasing availability of firearms led to its extinction over large areas. Heavy hunting by British colonial officers and Indian rulers caused a steady and marked decline of lion numbers in the country. Lions were exterminated in Palamau by 1814, in Baroda, Haryana, and Ahmedabad district in the 1830s, in Kot Diji and Damo in the 1840s. During the Indian Rebellion of 1857, a British officer shot 300 lions. The last lions of Gwalior and Rewa were shot in the 1860s. One lion was killed near Allahabad in 1866. The last lion of Mount Abu in Rajasthan was spotted in 1872. By the late 1870s, lions were extinct in Rajasthan. By 1880, no lion survived in Guna, Disa and Palanpur districts, and only about a dozen lions were left in Junagadh district. 
By the turn of the century, the Gur forest held the only Asiatic lion population in India, which was protected by the Nawab of Junagar in his private hunting grounds. Ecology and behavior Male Asiatic lions are solitary or associate with up to three males forming a loose pride. Pairs of males rest, hunt and feed together, and display marking behavior at the same sites. Females associate with up to twelve females forming a stronger pride together with their cubs. They share large carcasses among each other, but seldom with males. Female and male lions usually associate only for a few days when mating, but rarely travel and feed together. Results of a radio telemetry study indicate that annual home ranges of male lions vary from 144 to 230 square kilometers, 56 to 89 square miles in dry and wet seasons. Home ranges of females are smaller, varying between 67 and 85 square kilometers, 26 and 33 square miles. During hot and dry seasons, they favor densely vegetated and shady riverine habitats, where prey species also congregate. Coalitions of males defend home ranges containing one or more female prides. Together, they hold a territory for a longer time than single lions. Males in coalitions of three to four individuals exhibit a pronounced hierarchy with one male dominating the others. Topic. Feeding ecology In general, lions prefer large prey species within a weight range of 190 to 550 kilograms (420 to 1210 pounds) irrespective of their availability. Domestic cattle have historically been a major component of the Asiatic lion's diet in the Gur Forest. Inside the Gur Forest National Park, lions predominantly kill chital, sambar, nilgai, cattle, buffalo, and less frequently also wild boar. They most commonly kill chital, which weighs only around 50 kg They prey on sambar deer when latter descend from the hills during summer. Outside the protected area where wild prey species do not occur, lions prey on buffalo and cattle, rarely also on camel. They kill most prey less than 100 meters 330 feet away from water bodies, charge prey from close range and drag carcasses into dense cover. In 1974, the Forest Department estimated the wild ungulate population at 9,650 individuals. In the following decades, the wild ungulate population has grown consistently to 31,490 in 1990 and 64,850 in 2010, including 52,490 chital, 4,440 wild boar, 4,000 sambar, 2,890 nilgai, 740 chinkara, and 294 horned antelope. In contrast, populations of domestic buffalo and cattle declined following resettlement, largely due to direct removal of resident livestock from the Gur Conservation Area. The population of 24,250 domestic livestock in the 1970s declined to 12,500 by the mid-1980s, but increased to 23,440 animals in 2010. Following changes in both predator and prey communities, Asiatic lions shifted their predation patterns. Today, very few livestock kills occur within the sanctuary, and instead most occur in peripheral villages. Depredation records indicate that in and around the Gur forest, lions killed on average 2,023 livestock annually between 2005 and 2009, and an additional 696 individuals in satellite areas. Dominant males consume about 47% more from kills than their coalition partners. Aggression between partners increases when coalitions are large, but kills are small. Topic. Reproduction Asiatic lions mate foremost between September and January. Mating lasts three to six days. During these days, they usually do not hunt, but only drink water. Gestation lasts about 110 days. Litters comprise one to four cubs. Dominant males mate more frequently than their coalition partners. During a study carried out between December 2012 and December 2016, three females were observed switching mating partners in favor of the dominant male. The average interval between births is 24 months, unless cubs die due to infanticide by adult males or because of diseases and injuries. Cubs become independent at the age of about two years. 
Subadult males leave their natal pride latest at the age of three years and become nomads until they establish their own territory. Topic: <laughs> Sympatric carnivores. Carnivores that are sympatric with the Asiatic lion in the Gur Forest National Park and surrounding landscapes include Indian leopard, striped hyena, jungle cat, Asiatic wildcat and rusty spotted cat. The golden jackal scavenges on carcasses of large herbivores and preys on chital fawn and Indian hare. <laughs> lion and tiger Until the end of the 19th century, the Asiatic lion coexisted with the tiger in parts of Western and Central Asia, and in India. The lion and Caspian tiger occurred in northern Iraq, and in Transcaucasia, but in different habitats. In India, the Bengal tiger occurs in the border triangle of Gujarat, Maharashtra and Madhya Pradesh. <laughs> Threats The Asiatic lion currently exists as a single subpopulation, and is thus vulnerable to extinction from unpredictable events, such as an epidemic or large forest fire. There are indications of poaching incidents in recent years. There are reports that organized gangs have switched attention from tigers to these lions. There have also been a number of drowning incidents after lions fell into wells. Nearly 25 lions in the vicinity of Gur Forest were found dead in October 2018. Four of them had died because of canine distemper virus, the same virus that had killed several Serengeti lions earlier. Prior to the resettlement of Maldharis, the Gur forest was heavily degraded and used by livestock, which competed with and restricted the population sizes of native ungulates. Various studies reveal tremendous habitat recovery and increases in wild ungulate populations following the Maldhari resettlement during the last four decades. Conflicts with humans Since the mid-1990s, the Asiatic lion population has increased to an extent that by 2015 about a third resided outside the protected area. Hence, conflict between local residents and wildlife also increased. Local people protect their crops from nilgai, wild pigs and other herbivores by using electrical fences that are powered with high voltage. Some consider the presence of predators a benefit, as latter keep the herbivore population in check. But some people also fear the lions and killed several in retaliation for attacks on livestock. In July 2012, a lion dragged a man from the veranda of his house and killed him about 50 to 60 kilometers (31 to 37 miles) from the Gur Forest National Park. This was the second attack by a lion in this area, six months after a 25-year-old man was attacked and killed in Dodadar. Conservation Panthera leo persica was included on sites Appendix I, and is fully protected in India. Reintroduction India In the 1950s, biologists advised the Indian government to re-establish at least one wild population in the Asiatic lion's former range to ensure the population's reproductive health and to prevent it from being affected by an outbreak of an epidemic. In 1956, the Indian Board for Wildlife accepted a proposal by the government of Uttar Pradesh to establish a new sanctuary for the envisaged reintroduction, that is Chandra Prabha Wildlife Sanctuary, covering 96 square kilometers (37 square miles) in eastern Uttar Pradesh, where climate, terrain and vegetation is similar to the conditions in the Gur Forest. In 1957, one male and two female wild-caught Asiatic lions were set free in the sanctuary. This population comprised 11 animals in 1965, which all disappeared thereafter. The Asiatic Lion Reintroduction Project to find an alternative habitat for reintroducing Asiatic lions was pursued in the early 1990s. Biologists from the Wildlife Institute of India assessed several potential translocation sites for their suitability regarding existing prey population and habitat conditions. The Palpur Kuno Wildlife Sanctuary, in northern Madhya Pradesh, was ranked as the most promising location, followed by Sita Mata Wildlife Sanctuary and Dara National Park. Until 2000, 1,100 families from 16 villages had been resettled from the Palpur Kuno Wildlife Sanctuary, and another 500 families from eight villages envisaged to be resettled. 
With this resettlement scheme, the protected area was expanded by 345 square kilometers, 133 square miles. Gujarat state officials resisted the relocation since it would make the Gur sanctuary lose its status as the world's only home of the Asiatic lion. Gujarat raised a number of objections to the proposal, and thus the matter went before the Indian Supreme Court. In April 2013, the Indian Supreme Court ordered the Gujarat state to send some of their Gur lions to Madhya Pradesh to establish a second population there. The court had given wildlife authorities six months to complete the transfer. The number of lions and which ones to be transported will be decided at a later date. As of now, the plan to shift lions to Kuno is in jeopardy, with Madhya Pradesh having apparently given up on acquiring lions from Gujarat. Topic: <inaudible> Iran. In 1977, Iran attempted to restore its lion population by transporting gur lions to Arzan National Park, but the project met resistance from the local population, and thus it was not implemented. However, this did not stop Iran from seeking to bring back the lion. Topic: In captivity. Until the late 1990s, captive Asiatic lions in Indian zoos were haphazardly interbred with African lions confiscated from circuses, leading to genetic pollution in the captive Asiatic lion stock. Once discovered, this led to the complete shutdown of the European and American endangered species breeding programs for Asiatic lions, as its founder animals were captive bred Asiatic lions originally imported from India and were ascertained to be intraspecific hybrids of African and Asian lions. In North American zoos, several Indian African lion crosses were inadvertently bred, and researchers noted that, the fecundity, reproductive success, and spermatozoal development improved dramatically. DNA fingerprinting studies of Asiatic lions have helped in identifying individuals with high genetic variability, which can be used for conservation breeding programs. In 2006, the Central Zoo Authority of India stopped breeding Indian African cross lions, stating that, hybrid lions have no conservation value and it is not worth to spend resources on them. Now only pure native Asiatic lions are bred in India. The Asiatic Lion International Studbook was initiated in 1977, followed in 1983 by the North American Species Survival Plan The North American population of captive Asiatic lions was composed of descendants of five founder lions, three of which were pure Asian and two were African or African-Asian hybrids. The lions kept in the framework of the SSP consisted of animals with high inbreeding coefficients. In the early 1990s, three European zoos imported pure Asiatic lions from India. London Zoo obtained two pairs the Zurich Zoologischer Garten, one pair, and the Helsinki Zoo, one male and two females. In 1994, the European Endangered Species Programme for Asiatic lions was initiated. The European Association of Zoos and Aquaria EAZA published the first European studbook in 1999. By 2005, there were 80 Asiatic lions kept in the EAP. The only captive population outside of India, there are now over 100 Asiatic lions in the EAP. The SSP did not yet resume. Pure-bred Asiatic lions are needed to form a new founder population for breeding in American zoos. Topic in culture Topic. South and East Asia The Sanskrit word for lion is Sinha Simha, which also signifies the Leo of the zodiac. The Mahabharata, Sanskrit, Mahabharata contains literature on the lion, such as a comparison to the tiger. Since ancient times, lion statues adorned palaces and temples and other important buildings in India, and in Buddhist culture, the lion was depicted as the protector of Dharma. In Hinduism lions are associated with gods and goddesses. Narasimha Narasing or Narasinga, man -lion, is described as an incarnation avatar of Vishnu within the Puranic texts of Hinduism and is worshipped as lion god. Thus, Asiatic lions are considered sacred by all Hindus in India. A lion-faced Dakini also appears in Hinduism and Tibetan Buddhism. The Hindu deity is known as Narasimha and the Tibetan Buddhist form is known as Simamukha in Sanskrit and Senj Dongma in Tibetan. The lion is found on numerous flags and coats of arms all across Asia and Europe, and also appears on the emblem of India and on the flag of Sri Lanka. 
Singhasana, meaning seat of a lion, is the traditional Sanskrit name for the throne of a Hindu kingdom in India and Sinhalese kingdom in Sri Lanka since antiquity. The surnames Singh, Singha and Sinha are related to the Prakrit word Simga and Sanskrit word Sim which refer to lions, tigers and leopards. These are common Hindu and Sikh surnames dating back over 2000 years to ancient India. They originally were only used by Rajputs, a Hindu Kshatriya or military caste in India since the 7th century. After the birth of the Khalsa Brotherhood in 1699, the Sikhs adopted the name, Singh, at the direction of Guru Gobind Singh. As this name was associated with higher classes and royalty, this action was to combat the prevalent caste system and discrimination by last name. Along with millions of Hindu Rajputs today, it is also used by up to 10 million Sikhs worldwide. The Sinhalese people are the majority ethnic group of Sri Lanka. The name Sinhala translates to lion's blood or lion people and refers to the myths regarding the descent of the legendary founder of the Sinhalese people 2,500 years ago, Prince Vijaya, who is said to have migrated from Singapore Simapura or Singur. The words Singa or Singam meaning courageous lion are used as an ending of many surnames, such as Virasinga, used by the Sinhala people, and Virasingam, used by the Tamil people. The name Sinhala comes from the belief that Vijaya's paternal grandfather was a lion. An alternative theory places Singapore in modern Sahore, which happens to be close to the Gur sanctuary. The lion is the symbol of Mahavira, the 24th and last Tirthankara in Jainism. In the Burmese and Sinhalese animal and planetary zodiac, the lion is the third animal zodiac of the Burmese and the sixth animal zodiac of the Sinhalese people of Sri Lanka. The lion is the basis of the lion dances that form part of the traditional Chinese New Year celebrations, and of similar customs in other Asian countries. Chinese guardian lions and their eastern, southeastern and southern Asian counterparts depicted in Chinese art were modeled on the basis of lions found in Indian temples. Buddhist monks, or possibly traders, possibly brought descriptions of sculpted lions guarding the entry to temples to China. Chinese sculptors then used the description to model Fo lions. Fo Chinese, Fu is a character for the Buddha temple statues after native dogs, possibly the Tibetan Mastiff, by adding a shaggy mane. Depictions of these Fo lions have been found in Chinese religious art as early as 208 BC. The Tibetan snow lion, Tibetan, Wiley, Gang Seng Ge, is a mythical animal of Tibet. It symbolizes fearlessness, unconditional cheerfulness, the eastern quadrant and the element of earth. It is said to range over mountains, and is commonly pictured as being white with a turquoise mane. Two snow lions appear on the flag of Tibet. Many East Asian languages borrowed from the Sanskrit word for lion. Cambodia has a native martial art called El Bukatau Khmer, pounding a lion. The island nation of Singapore Singapura derives its name from the Malay words Singa lion and Pura city, which in turn is from the Sanskrit Simha Sinha and Pura. Pura. According to the Malay annals, this name was given by a 13th century Sumatran Malay prince named Sang Nila Utama, who, on alighting the island after a thunderstorm, spotted an auspicious beast on shore that his chief minister identified as an Asiatic lion. Recent studies of Singapore indicate lions have never lived there, unlike the tiger. Therefore, the animal seen by Sang Nila Utama would more likely have been a tiger, though it would be odd for them not to recognize one. <inaudible> West Asia and East Europe The lion makes repeated appearances in the Bible, most notably as having fought Samson in the Book of Judges. Having occurred in the Arab world, particularly the Arabian Peninsula, the Asiatic lion has significance in Arab and Islamic culture. For example, Surat al muddathir of the Quran criticizes people who were averse to the Islamic prophet Muhammad's teachings, such as that the rich have an obligation to donate wealth to the poor, comparing their attitude to itself, with the response of prey to a kaswara Arabic, ka s warat meaning, lion, beast of prey, or hunter. Other Arabic words for lion include asad Arabic, asa d and saba Arabic, sab ba, and they can be used as names of places or titles of people. An Arabic toponym for the Levantine city of Beersheba Arabic, by y r al sab b, can mean spring of the lion, 
Figures with a reputation for bravery, like Ali ibn Abi Talib and Hamza ibn Abdul Muttalib, who were loyal kinsmen of Muhammad, were given titles like Asad Allah, Arabic, Asadiyya, Lion of God. Depictions of the Mesopotamian lion show that it was an important symbol of ancient Iraq. It is depicted in Ninevan reliefs. Depictions on the Ishtar Gate of Babylon also has a well-known statue of the lion, and in Nimrud. The lion has an important association with the figure Gilgamesh, as demonstrated in his epic. Construction for Iraqi capital city of Baghdad began in July, 764 CE, so that it occurred under the lion's astrological sign, Leo. The Iraqi national football team is nicknamed, Lions of Mesopotamia. The symbol of the lion is closely tied to the Persian people. Achaemenid kings were known to carry the symbol of the lion on their thrones and garments. The name Shir also pronounced Sher Persian, Shur is a part of the names of many places in Iran and Central Asia, like those of city of Shiraz and the Sharabad River, and had been adopted into other languages, like Hindi. The Shir va Korshid Persian, Shir w Lion and Sun is one of the most prominent symbols of Iran, dating back to the Safavid dynasty, and having been used on the flag of Iran, until 1979. Nevertheless, in Persian literature, as with Indian literature, the lion is rivaled by the tiger. This is demonstrated in the book Anvar i Saheli Persian, Anwari Lights of the Canopus. The lion was an objective of hunting in the Caucasus, by both locals and foreigners. The locals were called Shervanshaks. The Nemean lion of pre-literate Greek myth is associated with the labors of Heracles. References Further reading See also Lion populations, West African lion Central African lion Asiatic lion East African lion Southern African lion Barbary lion Cape lion Lions in European lion American lion Topic. External links IUCN, SSC CAT Specialist Group, Asiatic Lion The Telegraph, August 2018, Pride of India Asiatic Lion Information Center at the Wayback Machine archived August 25, 2010 Asiatic Lion Protection Society Alps, Gujarat, India Archive.org, Lion Panthera Leo Animal Diversity Web, Panthera Leo Asiatic Lions in Online Video, 3 videos Asiatic Lions Images Aj Talk Video News Report in Hindi, Gur Lions in Pauper Kuno Century Report Rajesh Badal.mp4 on YouTube by Rajesh Badal, 2011 DB Video Special Report on Asiatic Lion in Gujarati, What is the Connection Between Gur Lions and Africans Lions Skin of a Persian lioness, belonging to an endangered subspecies of lions, brought to Dublin by King Edward VII in 1902 during the reign of Shah Mazafar ad-Din in Persia, and kept in the Natural History Museum Ireland. Lion of Basra A lion in Iraq Stuffed animals including Pakistan's last wild lion at Bahawalpur Zoo Ancient Arabian account of Muhammad's descendant Musa al-Qadim encountering a lion outside Medina in the mountainous region of the Hejaz Description of the Arabian lion and art For Anwa Alast Fi Alam Alast Awrbi Alj in Arabic Alast Awrbi Almkurd and Alarb Lion Arabian Extinct in Arabic